Reyes continues her search for Foster using the Frost Grip to resist the relentless attacks of the foul creatures that lurk throughout the underground base. The path ahead follows a trail of blood between the corpses of the base personnel and dead Section 8 soldiers who have managed to make it this far into the bowels of the facility. What began as a routine infiltration mission has become a desperate battle for survival. I mean, that's some next level engineering. How the hell did you get here? Looks like a clean cut. How is that possible? Probably some sort of weapon. Okay, it looks like part of a wing of an airliner. The scan sample was a clean cut with a glowing surface. I haven't been able to identify what kind of technology will be capable of doing this. It also seems to have the residue or residual electromagnetic frequency almost identical to that emitting by those strange beings. The presence of the object of its current location is completely inexplic inexplicable. Maybe the higher levels will be able to shed more light on it. Seems like I need a key to operate the elevator. Other puzzle? Oh, Frost Grip Upgrade Station. Okay, so this station will be disabled after upgrade, so I can only pick one. Recharge rate increased, tank capacity increased, uh, the station, uh, an improved cooling system spray, freeze effectiveness of the spray, or range. Wow. Let's go with the freeze power. Okay. Got the key card and we got a manual. And attention, and in the event that the system, I mean security system is activated due to the ongoing emergency, the entire water supply facility will automatically be sealed off. The contaminant protocol entails a total stoppage of the RXD elevator in the main area. This will make it impossible to leave the facility or reach the lower levels without the emergency release key that is housed in the release key box. The closing off of certain internal areas to any operator not in possession of the maximum security level badge. Internal staff and emergency services will retain access to the upper and lower levels of the facility via the emergency ladders located in these security rooms. If an emergency situation arises in your sector, contact your supervisor immediately.
so I can't use this key card here, even though it's a key swipe. You can use the electromagnetic key card to, yeah. Use, there we go. Oh, I must have hit examine. Briefcase. If it's our briefcase, that means he met Foster. I have to get to him. Okay, so still on the look for more frost grip. got here another med kit yep that'll come in handy what you got sir ammo get reloaded I hate that doors close behind you Note to computer technician. Uh, it's only a few, it's only taken a few decades, but the geniuses who run this place have finally decided to update security protocols. At the request of your buddies at the US Pro Progress, my team and I have been working 12 hours straight, shifts, installing cameras everywhere, and setting up new security checkpoints. I know what you're asking yourself, and the answer is yes. We've also installed the new v2 badge clearance upgrade system i've taken it for a test drive and everything seems to be in perfect working order i've never seen such a simple and intuitive system now you just have to input all the water supply facility staff data and designate their relative security levels remind them to reset their personal access codes at the terminal for now the provisional codes are written on strips of adhesive tape affixed to each badge it's all yours have fun tom all right so we're definitely going to need to find somebody's badge i guess i'd put my badge for upgrade if i had one all right cool we need to come across a badge well, that's the door i'm assuming that needs the badge all right so let's just continue down the creepy hallway Sergeant. Gora? Yeah, yes. 
a Hades soldier found us. He had it. He, he dropped it near me, and I... Where's he now? Uh, who? Where's this Hades soldier? I don't know. He and Gora were fighting. Then those monsters turned up, and... I don't know. I ran away. Maybe Gora killed him. You've been hit. Don't try to move. He was the one who shot me. Your friend. Why are you doing this to us? Are you trying to silence us? People died here! I have no fucking idea what happened in this shithole. People need to know. You must know something. Those monsters. I saw them teleport with my own eyes. Tell me how. Uh, in theory, it shouldn't be possible. But they must have found a way. Matter transfer. That was the aim of the research. They actually pulled it off. Those motherfuckers. Revolution. An unprecedented technological advance. But how? What are those clusters of electricity? And why do they bring corpses back to life? <laughs> they were manipulating the structure of electromagnetic fields. It seemed like a baseless theory, but then they made a discovery that changed everything. In that briefcase, I'm not sure, but... Blind like everyone else. This is what you want, isn't it? It's the only thing you care about. You'll never get it! What do you want from me? No, don't come any closer. I didn't do anything to you. Get back, get back, leave me alone! Are you receiving me? I need an extraction point. I've recovered the briefcase. I repeat, I've recovered the briefcase. Shit. I'll have to get closer to the surface. I'm sorry, Foster, but I have to get this briefcase out of here. Okay. Again, I need the card. I was hoping that would work. I could shoot the uh, lock off. Ah, perfect. Nothing down this way, except for a locked door. Let's head up. Uh. 
Where the hell are they pumping all this water to? I'm assuming they're trying to keep something cool. And I am racking up on first aid kids. That means they're really going to give me a fight now. D elevator emergency key. All right, let's take a look at that. Aha. Throw down a quick save. So now we got the ele uh, the elevator emergency key. Now we still need to find a key card. Get out of here. Get out of here. Much better. Try to get my thing recharged. I need a security badge to open it. Okay, so I can't use my key here. Oh. So that's the collectible noise. Okay, I really didn't know what it was. Now, if I hear it, I will look for it. Good, my stuff is almost recharged. Point. I'm making my way back to the surface. It's a mess down here. What the hell is going on? I lost contact with the others. I can't. Vulcan, get me out of here. I tried to warn you. Now with this storm, it's practically impossible to guarantee extraction. I'll do what I can, but I'm going to need a precise location. Where the hell are you? I, I don't know. I'm climbing some kind of weird water tower. This place is a fucking death trap. I lost contact with Foster and Roddick got left behind. He's injured. As soon as I reach the surface, I'll be able to give you more details, if I make it in one piece. Okay, so this brings us back up here where the plane is. Holy hell. So 
that's where the rest of the plane went. Yeah, I didn't know whether I needed to go up here or B3, but we'll see what's up. Damn, that man got smashed by an engine. Oh, does this hurt me? Okay, it doesn't. What? It's losing charge. What's wrong with it? Oh, jeez, that's not good. This malfunction is not a permanent thing. First boss. yet Shotgun for the win. Here we got two doors. This one needs okay. I gotta lock it from unlock it from the other side. Orders by fax. Standard logistics protocol during the first week of every month, Dr. Krieg. And his team will arrive by helicopter direct from KS headquarters to perform a routine check on the DTX input systems. During the third week of every month, storage room stocks will be replenished and empty containers will be removed. As per procedure, all service documentations must be countersigned by the facility supervisor and faxed. Wow, that's old facts. To the office within 60 minutes of receipt. Important, all personnel are reminded that access to the DTX storage room and to the level B1 laboratories is forbidden to basic level water supply plant staff. Anybody violating these regulations will be detained by site security and subject to severe punishment. Jack Hendricks, Director of Logistics, United States Department of Defense. Uh, can I use that? Yes, I can. Perfect. All right, so I got 45 seconds, 5K4, JB. Let's go. Uh, 
five. J. Oh, whoops, I messed up. Ah. Almost had it. Okay. Oh, I did get it. Nice. High capacity magazine. There we go. Okay, I actually had to put it in. Nice. Uh, let me make sure. Okay, so that one was the one that was locked on the other side. All these weird static noises. just puts me on this side of it. Okay. Which one was the one I just got? Was it chat description? Oh yeah. Request connection to emergency network connection implemented USP 27 auto operator online. Greetings. How can I be of service? What are you making me talk to the fucking machine? I know someone's reading this. Send assistance immediately. I'm in the upper warehouse. The elevator to the external exit isn't responding. Uh, attention user, you are kindly requested to provide more detailed information regarding your emergency request. You bastard, I'm trapped in here. Those things, I can't get down to the lower levels to reset my badge without them catching me. What the hell happened in here? Why haven't you sent anyone to evacuate the high level personnel yet? Answer me, goddammit. Attention user, if you are experiencing issues with your personal identification badge, you are advised to access the nearest V2 badge clearance upgrade system in order to restore your level of security clearance using your personal password. We trust that this has resolved your issue. That's horrible. <laughs> what? Why the fuck is my badge not working? I'm a manager with the highest level of security clearance. Is anybody reading this? I repeat, I can't access the upgrade terminal. We're sorry. We apologize for your inconvenience. Please try again again. Please try again later. That is the funniest thing, because I know he was losing his mind <laughs> talking to an automated machine when electric zombies are trying to kill you. All right, so we got a punched card. This fucking badge doesn't have a high enough security level. So now I got to take it back the downstairs. I get out of here. Thanks. So the, it looks like the fastest way for me to do that is to go downstairs. Let me just see if there was anything in here that I might have missed. Is 
There is a button here, but of course I can't push it. Doesn't look like I missed anything in this room. Alright, let's go around, get back to the elevator, and head downstairs. Okay, high capacity clip. I sees you. Oh yeah. So that was that way. Alright, we gotta go back through this room where we fought that. Oh! Okay. this room Oh, what the hell? God damn it! Why won't you leave me alone? Okay, am I back on B3? Am I on the other side? I think I am. Yeah, I am. But you get close. Good stuff. Just find the terminal room again. Get out of here, dude. Oh, this was the upgrade station. Come on. I missed my shot. Oh crap.
So it looks like the orb can only possess two bodies. Well, that's good. Right, so, let me see. Was it down this way? just came in the door. <laughs> Let me check this room. I think I'm clear. his password uh, let me take a look at my documents oh you know what I think it's on the badge yep zero zero three five there we go spot there we go this one is oh what oh this guy okay it's upgraded to the maximum level Let's go back up, Delilah. I still can't use this door. Making sure all my stuff is reloaded. I'm pretty sure. I can't stop <laughs> once I go up the stairs. I was about to say, I'm pretty sure it would have been faster if I would have just ran back that hallway I just came from and just used the elevator instead of having to go through all of this again. Not too bad. That's all that was in here with some ammo and a frost grip. 
was a little underwhelming. Ah, what the hell was that? Oh, I thought I saw something big stomping around. It was just a reflection. All right, let me use my max min security badge. Thank you. Okay, doors open. There's another elevator. Let me just make sure there wasn't anything else here that I could have possibly used my badge for. I don't think so. I don't think I missed anything up here. No, we're good. Yeah, because this is where I got the key from. Yep. Alright, we're good. Ah, this is the lab. Hell yeah. Oh. Okay, we got some supervisor notes. How much longer am I supposed to put up with that shithead Craig and his pack of mongrels? How long do I have to listen to them mocking me and my work? Niggering like a filthy scum they are? I guess a snickering? Uh, I'm the supervisor here. I'm the one who ensures that drinking water is distributed throughout this vast underground labyrinth. Keeping operations running smoothly with the precision of a Swiss watch. If there's life down here, dozens of floors under the fucking desert is only thanks to me. And yet nobody seems to show me the slightest hint of gratitude. These assholes come in here like they own the fucking place and the department lets them get away with it. But I know why everybody knows why. Fuck them and fuck their company. One of these days I'm going to lock them inside their precious, their precious pressure chamber and give them a taste or rather a breath of their own medicine. We'll see who's laughing then. Yeah, he sounds like the type of supervisor that's going to come to work with a gun. That's exactly what he sounds like. That man is pissed. But at this point, everybody's dead, so he got exactly what he wanted.
I think that's the first time I actually completed one of the little collectible things. What we got here? Yes, another frost grip. And another upgrade station. Hell yeah. Okay, so last time I got freezing power increased. I can't do that again. Or can I? No, I think it's it. Uh, tank capacity increased, recharge rate increased, range increased. Mm. Yeah, let's go with tank capacity. All right. Oh, nice. So it's more effective and I have a bigger tank. Oh, wrong way. You gotta go around. breathing and who's that guy Gora open his door oh he's gone I was gonna shoot that man in the face making me breathe whatever the hell that was over. 